In this video, I'm going to paint a portrait of Frank Sinatra, as well as creating a shirt custom also with Frank Sinatra and his songs. So the portrait is going to be only in one color and it's in Payne's gray, which I find is a very interesting and unique color. It's like very grayish, bluish, has a touch of black. It's very interesting. I really enjoy painting with this one and with the brand Golden Fluid Acrylics, favorite brand and it kind of like works like oils, but it's acrylic, so it dries like super fast. And yeah, really looking forward to paint it and also with my new style that I've been tapping into recently. And other than that, I'm going to just show you like my workflow, my process. And when I have a thought I want to share, I'm going to do that as well. And I would say, let's start. So that's my working area and here on the wall I put two reference pictures. The one is in black and white, the other one in color. Then I have my easel with my canvas and my assistant wagon with the, all the equipment I need for this project. So I have my acrylics, some spray bottles with water, brushes, water and a mixing palette. So that's that. The only thing I still need to get from the other room is some like tissue paper. So whenever there's like dropping something too much or I don't know, you always need it. So that's that. And I'm going to get that now and then we'll get right into the painting.
So it's the third day now working on this project and I really enjoy how it is coming together. It has a very strong energy and I've really been enjoying working with these super strong contrasts like very dark areas, very light areas, detail work over there and the only thing that was challenging with this though was that the face in the reference picture was mainly mid-tones, like very flat, so I interpreted more lights and shadows into it and so that it would fit the whole painting. And yes, only thing left to do is just some more detail work and finishing up the background. Alright, so here is the finished painting and I really enjoyed painting this one. I challenged myself and didn't sketch up anything beforehand and painted very intuitively and whenever I wanted to try something new, I would do it. And that's definitely a big difference from my previous paintings because earlier I would sketch out everything beforehand, I would plan everything beforehand and with this one I didn't plan out anything at all. I just had reference pictures and that was it. So that was definitely a very important challenge and lesson for me to learn and I am really getting into painting like intuitively and with more emotion and I feel like now my paintings get more character and I'm very happy about that. The next video is going to be the shirt custom I was talking about in the intro, like I want to have both separated, focusing one video on the painting and one on the shirt custom. <clears throat> so next one is going to be that and yeah, I hope I'll see you there too.